I saw a, a statistic that you posted the other day is like 85% of photographers um, will go out of business within two years, you said? So 50% go, will go out of business within the first year. Mm -hmm. And this is, I think, a really wide pool, right? This includes like all like the hobbyists who pick up a camera and throw up a website and think they have a business now. 15% makes it to the third year and 2% makes it to the 10 year. People who are pushing the message like, just follow your dreams and money will follow. Like it doesn't quite work that way. If I followed my dream, I would be laying out on the beach and soaking in the sun all day. Yeah, <laughs> my dream would be playing in a heavy metal band. Right. <laughs> that would have been my dream when I was 18. But I do also believe that if you can make the two meet together, if you can now, do what you love, but also have a structure in place and a system in place to monetize it. Now that's the ideal world. That's right? the ideal world. I do think there's some fundamentals that everyone can apply to like not close. Right. Right. Mm -hmm. And I think that's what we're like, when you brought that statistic up, it made me think like, Oh, that's really sobering. Mm -hmm. I, I, we did a podcast recently and we talked about finances and, mm -hmm. and I was telling people, I was like the average wedding in America is only spending less than $2,000 on wedding photography and $1,000 on wedding filmmaking. 70% of brides, only for wedding filmmaking, only 1.5% of brides are spending more than five grand. That's a yeah, nationwide right. statistic. Mm -hmm. It's And it's real, there's enough data and anyone who's like, oh, there was only So you're after 1.5% of the market. <laughs> everyone is, and everyone's being funneled there. Everyone's yeah. being told like, raise your prices, raise your prices. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, the demand does not exist for all of us to raise our prices. You're gonna pretty much set it up that only the best people work. Because yeah. if everyone tries to go there, then the brides are gonna go, or we're all gonna have to lower our prices actually. Right, then it's a race to the bottom at that point. At that point, yeah. and so it's like, I'm always trying to tell people, I'm like, just figure out your market, mm -hmm. meet whatever the mm -hmm. demand is, mm -hmm. and be clever. Yeah. If you're in a market where the client brides don't care how good the work is, they don't care at all. Right. Hire people, shoot whatever, shoot 200 yeah. weddings, do a good job, deliver a good service. That's just as artistic in my mind. Yep. And just as creative, yep. and it doesn't yep. hurt the industry, and it doesn't destroy anybody.